Right, thank you very much. Let's uh, move on to decisions by the Police and Crime Commissioner, and that starts on page uh, 45. Um, and we're being asked to recommend to indicate uh, whether, it would, whether we wish to review further, scrutinise the decisions taken. So, are there any decisions, Commissioner, that you would like to point um, out or comment on? They are all in the reports. We will move on. Thank you very much. So, any panel members want to um, raise any issues on the decisions by the, by the Commissioner? Councillor Murphy. Thank you, Chair. The report also gives us notification indication of decisions to be taken and your decision to appoint a, a deputy. Without referring to specifics, but I'm aware of item 12 on the agenda today, that may have a bearing upon the decision to appoint a deputy. And I would ask you and your Chief Executive to consider withdrawing that proposal at present until item 12 has been dealt with in due course. Okay, before we go any further, just want to take some advice from Legal Officer Alison Stewart. Thank you, Chair. Um, the um, report before you about the decisions by the Cambridgeshire Police and Crime Commissioner um, are to be taken as the report before you in relation to um, the any reference that there may be an impact on, on the other reports coming forward is not to be decided in the context of this report. It's just the report that's before you that needs to be decided at the present time. Okay, thank you very much. Um, any other comments from panel members on the uh, decisions by the Commission? And we've been asked to note the key decisions taken by the Commissioner. Um, as well, so those are noted. Okay. Thank you very much. So, item number 11.